coming by here today to show you a new figure that I have. Now, um, if you see this figure, you're probably wondering why you've never seen it before. Uh, that's because it's a custom figure. Uh, this is a figure I made about a month ago, um, and it is of uh, Gabriel Knight from the uh, Gabriel Knight series of video games made by Sierra back in the 90s. Now, this is kind of a, uh, a joint effort for my fans of my uh, old computer game collection and my uh, Hot Toys fans. So I kind of combined the two gloves together, and uh, I got this guy. So yeah, this is this is Gabriel Knight. This is how he um, appeared in the games. Uh, in the first game, Sins of the Fathers, he wore the uh, the jeans, the uh, the white shirt, and the leather overcoat. Um, and the second and third game, he had the uh, longer brown hair. Um, so yeah, this is him right here. Come down a little bit, show you his pants, and he wears uh, cowboy boots too. So yeah, basically the uh, the recipe that went into making this guy. So basically this is a Hot Toys um, true type body. It's the uh, Slim Caucasian, I believe. The one with the, uh, the long hair. This this sculpt is actually the one from Hot Toys. I just, uh, it looks kind of like Gabriel Knight. So I um, I felt this was the, the best body to go with because they uh, had kind of that Gabriel Knight sculpt to it. I mean, obviously, it doesn't look exactly like it did in the game, but uh, it works, and I'm I'm an amateur custom figure maker, so I don't really have the, uh, the talent or the supplies to start making sculpts, so uh, this is the best I have, but I think it turned out pretty good. Uh, you've got the long trench coat. Um, I went to uh, a site called monkeydepot.com, and they have a bunch of 1-6 scale clothing. That's where I got the trench coat. Um, the uh, the jeans, the uh, the boots, the uh, and then the white shirt I got on eBay. Uh, it's a t-shirt. Um, the, the the cool thing though that I have here is the um, the, the his shot in Jaeger talisman that he, he finds in the first game and he wears through the uh, subsequent games. Um, I actually made this um, through. Uh, it took me quite a, quite a while because I didn't quite know how I was going to make it. Um, it's it's basically a uh, it's a piece of um, of glue, hot glue. I made a um, a little mold out of a piece of cardboard, um, filled it with glue, then took the cardboard out, and I had kind of this basic shape. And then I, I cut off all the little uh, circle things on the sides, and then crazy glued them back on. That way, because the the hot glue wasn't very sturdy. And then I um, I painted over it with a uh, gold uh, gold paint, and then I got the the green. On this end and the, the red on this one. Those who play the games know what the shot in your talisman looks like. Um, the, in the game is a carving of a lion on there. I couldn't quite do, but um, from a distance it looks fine. Um, yeah, I, tr I tried to do it with solder. I tried to do it with several things, but I found the hot glue worked the best. And then I got this this chain. Uh, it was It's supposed to be a bracelet that I got off um, Monkey Depot as well, and I just kind of cock glued it together and made the necklace. Uh, so yeah, that's basically it. Uh, you're never gonna, you're not gonna find this guy in any store or online. It's a, uh, it's mine. It's custom that I built. Um, basically, uh, I kind of wanted a, I wanted a collectible to represent, uh, the Gabriel Knight series, because it's one of my favorite, uh, video game series, um, of all time. I'm a uh, huge fan, and I wanted to have a figure, so I, um, kind of put all the resources together and I got this guy. Um cost about 80 bucks to do the whole thing. Not too bad seeing as your typical hot toys figure costs 150. Um he the only accessory he has is the uh the talisman. Um I know in the game he had like a dagger, but um I didn't feel like I needed that. I've, and uh he's got his hands in his pockets. That's kind of his pose from the first game against the uh street lamp. You'll know what I'm talking about if you play the game. But yeah, so that's my uh, my first 1-6 custom. Uh, hope you guys liked it. Stay tuned. More stuff on the way. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Catch y'all later.